Okay, Professor Dodge here, and would like to go over how to shut off properly the Prototrack SLX lathe. So a couple of things. This assumes you've got it started, you've been running it all day, and uh, you want to shut it down properly. There's a difference, by the way, between shutting this machine down at the end of the day and shutting it down in an emergency situation. If something goes wrong with a spindle, where the part comes out of the chuck, or there's something that doesn't look quite right, you're traveling in the wrong direction, the wrong way, you can always shut it off with this. Don't think for a minute that you have to go through this long procedure to shut off the machine in an emergency. This will shut off the machine. You just hit that big red button and it stops the motion of the spindle and it stops all the motion of the axes of the machine. So that's a little different. What we're gonna do today is show you how to shut it down at the end of the day. So first, you should have the machine in a position where you're, you're what's called the reference position, and that usually is where the tool will go at, at in, uh, a tool change or at the, end of the, uh, at the end of the process, the beginning and the end of the process, the reference position. So let's say that's where it is now. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna make sure that we're all done and we're going to go over here to the system key. The system key is rarely used. It's right over here, and you, it's, it brings up these soft keys that are down here. So that changes that. And so if you look at the soft keys here, the one we want, more or less obviously, is shutdown. So I hit shutdown. And then I have a warning that comes up here, and it says, do not shut off the main power toggle switch or the prototrack until the display reads, it is now safe to turn off the computer. So in other words, you need to do a couple of steps, and then you have to acknowledge this. So if you really want to shut down the machine, you hit the soft key that says yes. And now you'll see some blinking lights and you see the machine in the process just like when the, your computer, because it is a computer, and then when it comes up with a screen that says it is now safe to turn off your computer, you can do so. And to do so, we're going to hit this switch on the end. So after turning off the control at the computer, you'll go to the end of the machine and shut off this switch. Then we'll come back here and we'll shut off the main breaker. Well, that's the procedure for shutting the machine off. Remember that if you have an emergency, that big red button on the front control panel will shut everything down. But if you want to follow those steps at the end of the day or when you're done a particular job and putting uh, the machine away for the night.